Good afternoon guys, welcome to Life with Lena and if you guys are new here, please click that red subscribe button down below and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. I've been terrible with ending my vlogs lately, like for the past week I don't think I've said goodnight to you guys or goodbye to you guys in like a proper way. Actually no, yesterday I think I did say goodnight. But like three days in a row before yesterday I haven't said goodnight so I felt terrible about that. So I'm happy I think I did yesterday. And I will try to remember to do it tonight. I don't know why I've been forgetting. It's just, I don't know, like by the time I end the vlog, it's already like super late. But anyway, I showered, I'm making some soup quickly, and then I have to walk Cuba, pack up some orders, go to the post office later. I have to also pack up a giveaway prize. And I'm also returning my Snapchat spectacles. I absolutely hate that they film in like a circle. Um, it looks fine on Snapchat, but I don't use Snapchat that much. I wanted them to use in the vlogs, but it comes in a circle. Okay, somebody's at my door. Hold on. All right, that was my mommy. My mommy came home, and I finally got to put my soup in here, so it's cooking. I'm making some ramen, you know, that cheap stuff that costs like 20 cents or whatever. Okay, guys, finished packing up all the orders that have to go out today. You got the giveaway prize winner. This is a Snapchat spectacles I'm sending back. And then I have to mail this back um, for my mom. It's like a return for purchase she made. But the Snapchat spectacles are going to FedEx. I don't even know where I dropped that off, to be honest. I know where UPS is. I know where USPS is. But FedEx, I have no idea. Haven't vlogged much because I am just so annoyed, guys. Like... I keep trying to do get work done, you know, I was trying to get orders done, you know, pack them up. Even yesterday, like, every two seconds, my mom is asking me something, 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 something. How do I do this? How do I do this? Oh, I need you to do this. Oh, wait, I need to do, I need you to do this. And every, like, I, I don't even want to say, like, every hour, like, I'm trying to get things done, and my mom keeps bugging freaking crap out of me and I, I have just about had it I, I can't take it anymore to be honest I really can't and she literally just came into the room as I'm finishing up finishing up packing up orders she's like oh and by the way I need you to take me to the airport like excuse me you did not tell me you you knew you were going to Poland for months now and you couldn't have told me in advance that you needed me to take you to the airport like She's like, oh, but you know, your dad was gonna take me, but then the cars broke down, and you know, my dad still has a car. They could freaking take that car, I mean, I get, I get that it's messy. She could have told my dad ahead of time to clean the car. Simple. And now she's like, oh, I had somebody else, but why should I ask somebody else to take me if, um, you know, you could take me? Why can't you tell me this ahead of time? I would have been fine with it, but I wanted to go to Andre's house today, and I was planning on doing that because he said he was having a package from HelloFresh delivered, and so we could make some dinner together, and I am just so fed up. Like, I do not like these last minute things at all, and I'm like on the verge of a freaking breakdown because I want to get my shit done and not have anybody interrupt me or have me do this. Like, people just don't understand that I work from home, and it's so freaking annoying sometimes that they ask you to do things every like every two seconds you get interrupted by somebody because you know they don't consider it an actual job when it is a freaking job because if i'm getting paid and i'm making money and i have to work even though it's at home it's still a job and so there's my little rant for today i am gonna go to the post office now go for a drive blast some music try to relax a little bit but i am so fed up right now that i just i can't so i will talk to you guys in a little bit later so guys, because the FedEx is right next to Dunkin' Donuts, I decided I would get myself a nice coffee. I actually forgot to say light ice, but it's okay. I tr I'm trying a new flavor. It's coconut cream pie. If you guys like coconut, this is amazing. Oh my God. So much better than just the regular coconut flavor. So coconut cream pie, you guys have to try it. If you guys love coconut, it just tastes so yummy. And it tastes so much more coconutty than the actual coconut flavor that they have. Then I also decided to treat myself to a donut. I'm gonna try the s'mores donut. Look how yummy that looks, guys. It just looks so good. I'll try that when I get home, though. I have to go get gas now because, you know, when people drive my car, not only do they break everything, which my mom says the alarm randomly went off the other day, which is, no, like, my alarm has never gone off 
on its own before and my mom's like no it really just went off by itself and I'm like every time I let somebody borrow my car even though I had no choice but to let her borrow the car every time I do that something breaks down like the last time when my dad took it when I was in like Poland or Iceland I don't even know when but I came back to a window that would not open so every time I let somebody borrow my car something breaks down Anyway, we are running low on, whoa, why, I didn't mean to do that. We're running low on gas, so I have to go get some gas. Forgot to tell you guys that this is already sweet. So if you guys are getting this, just get it either with milk or cream or whatever you guys add into your coffee, but just don't add sugar because it's already pretty sweet. And I normally don't drink sugar in my coffee, but when it's like a syrup, it just, it tastes so good. Mm. I freaking love it. I'm gonna have this like all the time now. It's just so yummy. And I love their cups, like it says, go all in for summer, it says explore, summer Fridays, it has little pictures of sunglasses. Can you guys see? Oh, speaking of sunglasses, I gotta take these off. I like to leave them in my car, but the cup is just so cute. Okay, one thing is done. My mom found a ride to the airport. There's a priest um, that she goes to church and this priest is picking up another priest from the airport at the same time that uh, my mom would need to go there. So my mom found a ride. Hallelujah. I wanted to tell Andre that I wanted to come over today. So I'm gonna let him know. And then if anything, I would have to be on my way right now, pretty much. Hello. Hi. Hi, love. I still at work. Yeah. What's up? Not much. I'm still at work. Did you get your HelloFresh package yet? No, it only comes on the 8th or whatever. Oh, uh, it's tomorrow. Oh, I thought I, I thought it was coming today and I was going to come over. No, it's not coming today. You could still come over, though. So, that is dumb. I guess we're not making any of that dinner today. I thought it's coming in today, but I guess not. But your battery is also dying, so I got I to gotta fix you guys up right now. I don't know what this guy's looking for, but he's looking for something over here. I just don't know what. What? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I don't know what you're looking for. Huh? What? What are you looking for? Oh my gosh, you're crazy. I don't see anything. I don't know what you want, mister. <laughs> I have no idea what he's looking for. What are you looking for? Is there something back there that I don't know about? <laughs> I don't know. Kuba's so smart. He does have a toy back here. I don't know how it got here. But, it's right here. You're so smart. <laughs> you know where everything is. Time to try this donut. Oh my god, it looks so yummy, delicious. Look at this beautiful donut, guys. Look how beautiful that is. Mom, you want a piece of a donut? Ooh, look at this, guys. There's like a cream filling inside. Oh my gosh, such a good donut. Checking in on my basil, it actually looks like it's grown. I felt like, you know, some pieces look like they weren't growing, but I feel like it's all full again. I don't know. I mean, actually, no, maybe not. Like, I cut this piece off. Is that supposed to grow back, or is just other stuff supposed to grow? I cut this piece off right there. Um, I guess there's pieces that I cut off, and I don't know if those same pieces are supposed to grow, or what's happening. Like, I even cut these pieces off right here. And this two, these two aren't growing. Um, I cut this one off. That's not growing. I, is it, I don't know, guys. If you guys... Oh, no. This one's dying. <gasps> no, don't die. Why are you dying? <gasps> don't die. Why are you dying? Oh, my gosh. I killed it. Did I kill it? I hope I didn't kill it. Oh, my gosh. Um, so, you know, if you cut off too much, they die. Anyway, I am going to Burger King right now. I'm going to go get my mom a burger. She wanted... Um, a burger because she's running around and she's hungry and she's trying to finish packing so I'm getting her a burger and then um, as soon as Andre calls me I'll be on my way to Astoria then too. So Andre just phoned me that means I'm gonna be on my way I'm gonna take my iced coffee with me because I did not yet finish it I was drinking so much of it when I got it and then you know me and coffee it's just been sitting here and it like separated a little bit so I'm terrible but I'm gonna be on my way so at least I'll drink that in my car when I'm driving to Andre. I feel like I haven't been in Astoria in forever. So I haven't been in Astoria in so freaking long, guys. Oh my gosh, like, so long. 
And um, so I found a parking at first and then I was like, wait, I don't know if I'll fit here. And I kept trying to fit into there, but it just like wasn't working out. And I don't know if I also forgot to parallel park for a little bit there, but like it was not working out to the point where I was just like so frustrated that I couldn't get in that spot and I couldn't get close enough to even try to get in that spot. But I think it was also just like a really, really tight spot if I was able to fit. And if not, then, well, I just wasted my time. But I found another parking that was a guy just leaving and I was like, oh my God, are you leaving? sir and then he's like yeah I'm leaving and I'm like oh my gosh thank you and I took over his parking spot like in the city you legit take over people's parking spots you just wait for somebody to leave and then somebody like zooms right in that's how it is parking in the city in case you guys haven't seen Andre's room in a while <laughs> here we go Pretty much the same as uh, the yeah I mean wait wasn't there something up there no but there was that what, thing uh, the black flag maybe Black flag was there a while ago, but it went back into the living room. Oh, so that just means and there was like that, there was that plastic thing down there. Hi! I, and that was like a silent hi at first. What was that? Like a, yeah, it didn't come out. <laughs> it didn't come out. I have those times too. Like, sometimes you want to say something, it just doesn't come out, right? Hi, <laughs> babe. Andre said, I say with my mouth. Andre said welcome back to me. <laughs> Yeah. I haven't been here in like so, three or so months. I don't even know. So I think I told you guys um, back when I was switching to like an online bank, I signed up with Allie. And Allie basically, I don't know if it's Ally or Allie. It's A-L-L-Y. I like Allie better. Andre says it's called Ally, but whatever. So they have this thing where um, they have certain dollars that are worth money. So I'm like collecting all of my single dollar bills. And what you do is plug in the serial number of it, the series. Um, you just like check your dollars and you can win like up to 10 grand for one dollar that if you find like the winning dollar and then you give them your name and email and stuff so i'm gonna check my dollars and hope that one of them is a winning dollar right here okay i checked two so far and i'm submitting the last one we'll see hopefully it's a winner wait why is it not working submit what the hell why isn't oh i consent got a consent okay Aw oh, man, I didn't win, but I have until July 31st to win up to $10,000. Other times I think it's only like 100, but here has been like some winning dollars so far. We just went to the grocery store and I totally didn't vlog, but I'm gonna show you guys what we got because Andre is gonna cook some dinner. So we went to this place called Green Bay, definitely the most overpriced place ever. So don't go here if there's another grocery store near you and they don't sell anything pork. So they didn't have the bacon and they didn't have prosciutto, so, we got some all natural chicken, no added hormone thingies. We got some coconut sorbet. We're gonna try this brand. We've never tried this one before, so we're gonna try it because me and Andre love coconut. We got some mozzarella balls. And let's see, in here we got some asparagus. And we got some duck bacon because Andre wanted that. And I wanted turkey bacon because I don't know how I feel about eating duck. I would have had a regular bacon, but when you say duck, I mean, nuh-uh. So we got turkey bacon and we're gonna wrap the chicken and the asparagus in the bacon, so it's gonna be so, so yummy. Or actually, Andre's gonna do that because Andre is cooking dinner. Yeah. <laughs> I have to say, I was not expecting this to look like this. It was very interesting. <laughs> I was expecting something completely different. But this works. Mm -hmm. So while Andre has been cooking dinner and also on the phone with a phone meeting, I have been on Pinterest looking up scrapbooking ideas because I want to make a scrapbook for our one year anniversary. So I'm just trying to get some ideas to decide like what I want to do and just like different elements and things I could do with scrapbooking to incorporate. Me and Andre actually decided on not buying any gifts. We just said we were gonna go out to dinner, but that doesn't mean I can't make anything. So I'm still gonna make a scrapbook. I'm getting really excited. Like I'm just learning so much of like different elements you could do in scrapbooking. Like I never looked it up before. Before I would just, every time I used to make a scrapbook before, I would just combine a whole bunch of different photos, cut out, you know, like how I want it to be and add like some stickers and things like that. And they still came out really good. But now that I'm like looking at all these different elements you can incorporate, I'm just getting super, super excited to make a scrapbook for our one year anniversary, which is coming up at the end of this month. So I need to get crack a on that. I also got to pick out my photos, get them printed at like CVS or wherever. So I have a lot of work to do. It's probably going to take me like a week to fully complete everything. 
um, but it'll totally be, be worth it. So not only is Andre slaving in the kitchen, but he also brought me over a glass of wine. This is Rosé Moscato. It's pretty tasty. I actually got it like three months ago and it's still good. Andre had some last week too of my Moscato but it's pretty tasty still. I honestly don't think wine goes bad that fast. Not the sweet wines at least. The sweet wines tend to last pretty long. So food is all ready and cooked. Look how amazing that looks. And there's like some mozzarella cheese. Oh, that yellow light just totally killed it by the way. I don't think and so. then we also got some pasta. I don't know what's in here more. Turkey bacon it looks like. Maybe some regular bacon, I don't even know. No, but it's, it's turkey bacon. Some noodles. Andre also got these super cute um, new bowls. Like it's like not a bowl. I mean a plate, Which but it goes like up right. higher. I don't care. It goes up higher, so it's like perfect for anything with noodles, so that it doesn't like fall off your plate when you're walking around with it. Like I freaking love these bowls. I've never even seen anything like it before. Come close, come close. But it's awesome sauce. Ooh, yummies! My babe is a chef in hiding. Like this looks freaking amazing, guys. Okay guys, I worked on some art prints, or one art print that I want to list in my shop tomorrow. I really like it. I worked on one for it to post on Instagram, but then I was like, mm, that quote doesn't really go for an art print. So then I did another one with the same background and just did like another um, thing to make an art print. So I only have one art print for tomorrow to list on my new printable shop, but I'm so excited. Like with this whole calligraphy thing, I've been listing more and more stuff because like, I just want to do calligraphy and I just want to make like art on my iPad and it's been so much fun for me so I have another thing to list but anyway guys I am gonna change into jammies now oh I forgot to show you guys that we changed the bed sheet um, Andre didn't have a matching sheet to this so just a fitted sheet so then we flipped this comforter um, or duvet rather over because that should have been clean anyway because it had a sheet underneath the whole entire time Andre always sleeps with a sheet funny thing is that when I try to sleep with sheets The sheet always ends up scrunched up at the bottom of my feet or like halfway off the bed I cannot sleep with sheets for the life of me um, They just they never stay in place. They never do let me know in the comment section down below if you guys sleep with a sheet as well um, as a duvet or a comforter but or if you guys sleep without a sheet but I sleep without sheets normally because they just never work out for me. Anyway, I will see you guys tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please click that red subscribe button down below if you haven't done so already. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow's next daily vlog. Bye.